Hundreds of firearms are now banned in Canada, but not this one. Basically, if you're a gun owner in Canada and you own rifles, you've probably got an SKS. They're just that common. Originally a Soviet combat weapon, thousands of semi-automatic SKSs found their way into Canada after the fall of the Soviet Union. They were extremely inexpensive and you had uh, rifles coming over from former Soviet republics and you could buy them by the crate. In 2020, the federal government banned 1,500 assault weapons. This gun expert suspects the SKS didn't make the cut because of its older design and it takes longer to reload. But uh, if you're shot before somebody has to reload, the result is going to be the same regardless. The SKS has a violent history in Canada. Last week in Innisfil, Ontario, a man shot and killed two police officers with an SKS. It was the weapon of choice of the two men who murdered three people in B.C. and sparked a nationwide manhunt in 2019. And it was used by the Fredericton shooter, whose 2018 rampage locked down the city and killed four people, including two police officers. The SKS, for all uh, practical purposes, is a military weapon. It's actually still used in militaries across the world. Gun control advocates believe it should be banned. These weapons, just like all military-style assault weapons that are not reasonably used for hunting, they should be prohibited. While the Coalition for Firearms Rights says zeroing in on one gun isn't the answer. It needs serious dialogue, not just, well, we're going to ban this gun, wait till more violence happens with another firearm and then ban that one. It just doesn't make any sense. And Katie, you asked the federal government about the SKS and whether it could be banned. Yeah, so we put that question to Public Safety Minister Marco Mendicino today. He didn't really answer one way or the other. What he did say is that that work is being undertaken right now by the Standing Committee on Public Safety. They are reviewing the prohibited weapons list right now. And what he said today was essentially repeated by the spokesperson for Public Safety, which told us it's just too early in that process to say one way or the other whether or not the SKS rifle will be banned in Canada. Erica? Okay, Katie Nicholson in Toronto. Thank you.